Hello, today I'm going to show you how I do my vinyl straps. I'm going to be using gold marine vinyl. I'm going to use my sewing machine. It is a Fashion Mate Singer 237. I'm just using a regular foot and a universal 16 inch needle or six size 16 needle. My other tools that I like to use are quilting tape. I use the one fourth inch tape. And it's just a double sided sticky tape that's washable and it won't gum up your needles. So I've already cut out a strap here, just so you can see. So if you are using, or if you need a strap that say, what I'm making today is three quarters of an inch. You want to times that by four. So this is a, uh, three inches. And I've already prepped. I've marked the middle here with a pen. And then I've lined both sides of the line with the quilting tape. I'm also going to use my clips. And we do one side at a time. We take the backing off our tape and press your raw edge to the line that you've drawn on the back. Okay, and then clip those down or that side down. And then we're going to do the same thing to the other side. Okay. Move that tape back in. Okay. Tape down, press down. And you can, if you want to, Use clips for your other side as well, or you can just reclip as you go. Just fold that over, okay? And then when we sew it down, because it's vinyl, we want to use a bigger or a longer stitch length. And uh, the thread that I'm using is just uh, the Cokes and Clark dual duty, just regular thread. I don't use anything fancy. Okay. And then I top stitch about an eighth of an inch. So my needle's all the way over to the right. And I'm gonna stitch it along the edge of my foot, which actually matches up with the line right here which is half inch from the, or sorry, a quarter inch from the center. But since I moved my foot over, we're at one eighth of an inch. Okay. So on my 237, I generally use a, um, a stitch length of seven, maybe six. And then we just go back and forth. And again, I'm doing the side that has the fold on it first. Okay, and I just follow that opening there, or the line here. Oops, sorry. Forgot to put my phone on silent. And generally for this first part here, I'll go a little bit slower just to make sure my fold lines match up.
And then towards the end, a little back and forth. Get rid of my clips. Then, turn it around. We don't want to flip it because sometimes it'll have a tendency to t start to twist your vinyl like this. So I sew always on the same side that I'm sewing on from the other side versus flipping it over and do, doing the back side. Same thing again, back and forth. Okay. And then once that side's done, on the folded side, I can go faster on this side since I don't have to try and match my folds together. And just follow that line. Back and forth again. Then we're going to snip our thread. And that's it. So, excellent stitching. Hopefully that helps you guys. And um, should work with um, leather as well. And then I've also recently did it to another bag um, with upholstery. And then I had... Um, interfacing it in it as well so you can use it with more than just vinyl but yep that's how i do mine cheers